Hello, everyone. Thanks for tuning in again to American Whiskey Experience. Go on. Pete. Hello. James. Again, whiskey. thanks again. And whiskey. And, and a lot of whiskey. A lot of whiskey. That's all we do here is drink whiskey. It's not about We don't thing. work. We don't sleep. We just drink do these videos and do whiskey. Mm, yeah, that's all right. All right. What do we got today? So we have a Starlight Distillery product. We have um, Carl T's uh, Bottle and Bond. Yeah, get a little. Pretty cool, huh? So, Star love their bottles. Starlight by the way. is one of my favorite distilleries. I'm a huge fan, and I just I, I have a hard time not buying one. Yeah, we got we got hooked on them uh, summer of 20. Well, last summer, 20 last summer. summer. Yeah, yeah. Um, about May or June, I think we picked started picking yeah. up their bottles and kept on going. And right, I I have like four or five, and you have probably like ten. I have a lot. <laughs> yeah, I, I like them. I'm gonna pour like as them. you talk. Yeah. So this is a again bottled and bond, which means it's hundred proof. Ooh, um, nice. So this is a straight bourbon. <clears throat> yep. Um, so about four years old, minimum, minimum of four years old, maybe a little older. We don't okay. know. Um, a mash bill is undisclosed. Uh, Starlight typically doesn't tell you what they got in the bottle. No. Yeah. Um, and then MSRP on this one was fifty six. Yeah. So not a bad price uh, for for bottled and bond. Not in the low end, but it's quality. Yeah. Quality bottle, so I, I didn't mind spending a little more, and you know I like Starlight, so. Yeah, no, I think that's a good price. I for wanted it. to get, I wanted to kind of try their hundred proof version. I yeah. Think most of the stuff I have is like in the one fifteen range. Okay. So. Um, yeah, I'm, you know what? Thinking about it, everything is is, is a higher proof. So at a hundred proof, this is aged four and a half years, like you mentioned. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So. Batch number B two one zero one for those uh, playing at home. Yeah. Cool. Hundred proof. Yeah. Bottled in bond. Not too dark. No, uh, it's a standard, you know, a little coppery, uh, a little light, uh, lighter copper. Yeah, I, you know, we've had other ones that are darker than this from oh. them. So this is pretty, pretty tame, yep. uh, pretty standard. Oof, that's got a lot of nose on there. Crazy! I gave it a little spin. I closed it before, and it just hit me. And you boom! Yeah, <laughs> it tickled the nose. I mean, it's got a really sweet nose. It does, yeah. That's what you pick up a lot, real a lot quick. Of sweet, a lot of sweetness. A lot of sweetness. A lot of candied fruit type. Yeah. You I know, with that, that sweet I juice. Like the... You know, like the the juice and the peaches and the canned peaches and yeah. stuff like that. The, the, the syrup, that, yeah. The, the syrup, syrup, yeah. You're getting a lot of that. Yeah, Maybe like... not the peach, but just just no, yeah, no, but the syrupy the fruit. Syrupy sweet. Yeah. Which is I, great. I, I'm almost getting a little more apple than peach. Yeah, I can see that. Like sweet apple, like, uh, like gala or yeah. like, uh, like uh, those red apple, the nice red. Um, uh, what's the other one I really like? Uh, Fuji. Yeah. Fuji okay. or, yeah. or gala. Yeah, it wasn't. Yeah, definitely uh, not green like apple. Oh, not honey that. crisp. Oh, honey crisp. That makes sense. Get some apple. Yeah, there's apple there. Just a just a, a touch of oak. Not a lot. Just a little touch of oak. But more sweet than anything. A lot, of, a lot of sweet up front. Yeah. Um, that apple's there for sure. Yeah. It's definitely orchard fruit. There you go. There you go. Like that one? I like that one. Kind of generalized. Yeah, I'm going to use that for now. Hit, hit them all. Everything's going to be orchard fruit for Every, now. Orchard, orchard, this is orchard, <laughs> orchard fruit. Orchard fruit. Orchard fruit. <laughs> orchard fruit. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. Well, Cooking spice and orchard fruit. I got to taste it. So this, this has been open for about a week. Okay. So I cracked this last weekend. You didn't mark um, it. I, I didn't. I right. didn't. I just remember it was last week. Yeah. Weekend. Okay. So it's been open for about a week. Um, so I took a couple pours out of it. Yeah. Um, so I, I liked it up the hop. Uh, but now that it's that open for a little bit. Let's we'll see what it is like. Let's see. Cheers to you. Look. Cheers. Thanks for bringing it over. Hmm. Curious what you're gonna say. So it's weird because it before I even get to the palate taste of it, but it like starts off like dry, but then it kind of opens up, up and it sweetens up at the end. Mellows up. Color yeah, it's, it's it, 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 it's the finish is not dry. The tip of my tongue is a little heat. Yeah, it's a little heat, a little spice, um, dry, and then just kind of covers. And then it gets oily at the end. Oily. Yeah. Oily. Um, That's almost, weird. Almost like a, um, a creaminess to it. Mm -hmm. I don't get. I don't pick up now like the orchard fruit as much. I don't get any of the flavor that I got on or the nose. The, or the nose. No. No. And now I come. I'm getting a little more. I can tell there's a little bit of corn here. Yeah. So now I'm getting that that uh, cream corn, uh, that that caramel, that uh, those uh, those those candies with the vanilla inside, the caramel yeah. candy with the vanilla inside. I'm getting all that, and then a little bit of chocolate. 
on the back end, that's where I get those barrel mm -hmm. cannons. And yeah. I get that, 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 that charness. That, yeah, yeah. That comes through. So I'm getting that. Totally opposite of what I thought it was going to be based off the nose. Mm. And the fact that when I first took that sip, again, it was dry. And as it's going, it just, it just Smell mellows right out. Up. And it actually coats, coats your mouth. A lot of their bottles, they end up coating and you, you taste oh, yeah, that later for a while. On. You taste yeah. it. Now this one doesn't last as long, but no. I'm still getting it. No, I, it, it's not in the cheeks. I feel super so, prominent. No, but you still get a little bit. But it's it's definitely guys mm -hmm. a good mouthfeel and, and I can still taste flavor. There. I mean, but to be honest with you, it makes me want to have another sip. It does yeah? <laughs> you know, at 100 proof bottle and bond, I like that, and mm -hmm. it's a, it's, a, it's an easy drinker for me with still a lot of flavor. This is excellent, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I mean. Right? Yeah. You get a little, are you you're a little surprised? You know? I am because I yeah. wasn't. I you know. Listen. So so I don't know if you've seen any of our other videos, but a lot of the, they're products, all excellent products. So, so I should I shouldn't be not surprised. No, but a lot of the starlight we've had in the past have all been finished. Yeah. Finished. True. In, you know, VDN yeah. and honey. You know, honey, the rye, the rye, the rye are, are double oaked. A lot uh, of big flavor and a lot right. of finishing. Where this is just a very How simple, select. a simple bottle and bond. That's it. Non finished. Yeah. Um, not. Extremely old, four years or, or a little older, maybe. Yeah, four and a half years, it said, yeah. But, um, but good flavor. This drink's great. Wasn't it? Yeah. Wasn't it? Like, honestly, this might be one of the shortest videos we do because it's it's just really good. Uh, there's not much more to say. Yeah, it's just really good. I mean, it does, it's not overpowering with all different levels of flavors and stuff. It's a good, good whiskey. Whiskey. Good bourbon. It's yeah. a good, solid drink. bourbon. Yeah. Solid bourbon. I think, and I think this can be for anybody. Yeah. It's made new to whiskey. You know, mm -hmm. a new to like, drink whiskey straight. Um, you could drink this straight, you could drink it on the rocks. You want to smoke it? Yeah. Smoke it, maybe add a little flavor to or, it. Or put it in a drink, too. Or put it in a drink. Yeah. Yeah. No, absolutely. I think this is really good. This is really good. Again, I, I, I've, so I've seen, I go, I, so I got this from Beverage King in Norwalk. Okay. Um, so he's, his, he's the Starlight King of Connecticut. He is. Yeah. Pretty much. I think he owns stock in the place he now. He might. He might. Um, they might name that next Rick House after him or something. <laughs> or at least one row of them. Right, exactly. <laughs> um, so um, I've eyed this a couple times. Yeah. And I always have my hands full with a million other things. So, you so, so I, I, I didn't purchase it in the past. And yeah. I was like, I got to get that. I'm going to have to pick up a bottle of it because um, it's really, really surprisingly good. a lot better so, than I thought it was going to so be. I knew it was going to be good. I knew so it was going to be a good so drink. So they're regular, they're, 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 um, they have a barrel strength um, uh, Rick House yeah. that I like. It's 117 that I, I bought. I think I have that. Actually. I think you do have, yeah. one, you have one of those as well. Yeah. Um, so that I, I bought a couple times in the past. There's been a couple of picks. Yeah. Uh, Green, Green Farm did a pick. Yeah. Obviously, Brad King did a pick. I, I think I had the Green Farm. Um, very good. Yeah, but this is a little bit less proof, and I was like, I really want to try it to see how it is. Yeah, I like uh, the proof, and I just have not been disappointed at all. I, honestly, I think the proof at hundred is better than maybe being at like one, you know, the average one, one, yeah, one fourteen, one thirteen, one twenty, or or more. Actually, I like this. This could be a, a daily drinker. Absolutely, with, um, with a lot of flavor. With a lot of flavor, it's amazing the nose on this, and then what you get on the palate. It's totally different. They're very different. Totally different. Yeah, I'm still getting the, or or the fruit. Yeah, yeah, you get you're getting all that orchard apples as well. Well, little little touch of oak. Yeah, yeah. No, it's, this is really good all around. It's a great finish too on there. No, it, like I said, it, it's shorter. Yeah. It's not really long. No, it's not. But, but like for what for what it is, <clears throat> very yeah. good. I, honestly, when I first took that sip, I was a little nervous because I was like, "Wow, that's dry." And I'm not. Sure. I don't like the dry right. whiskeys and bourbons and ryes. But then all of a sudden, it opened up at the end. I was like, "Wow." It transitions that's, very well that's from a like great, different tongue yeah. to the back of the palate. It, it was great. Right up. Well, Again, this is going to be a short video because there's nothing. Right? Unless you pour another glass. Yeah, I mean, if you keep pouring, <laughs> I'll talk about it. We'll, we'll figure it out. But this is this is a winner. This is a no-brainer yeah. for me. If you see it, pick yeah. it up, bottled and bond. Uh, definitely, it's, 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 Starlight is becoming more and more popular. Keep doing some it's coming, it's coming through. They do great things. Any of their finished bottles, pick mm -hmm. up. Definitely check them out. Family then, owned, farm to table type products. Yeah. yeah. They do wine as well. They do, I think, vodkas and do they do gin? I, I think they do. I think they do. Yeah, so spirits. I think they do other spirits. Uh, I haven't as well. had any of those, but, but, they're, no. but they're whiskey. Fantastic. It's unbelievable. Check them out. Yeah. Start the distillery. Uh, yeah. Listen, there's no reason for us to keep talking about yeah. this product because it's, it's definitely a win. Without a doubt. Uh, if you don't have it on your rack, in your, at your bar, or on your table, or somewhere like that, pick it up. Uh, pick pick it it up. up. I recommend it. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, thanks. Cheers. Cheers.
Isn't it? Yeah. 